y'all i'm sitting in the drive-thru line to get a covid test because i'm just playing it safe like i already had it jump um like i think it's just the weather changing but by me working and more in school we try to keep an eye on it so and i had a headache but thank god it went away and i had a sore throat but y'all know i recently had a procedure done so yeah hopefully it's just regular but you know that's how i started i was like had a regular time of COVID, but i'm not saying it's that i think it's just the weather um this time i know it's just the weather but i'm playing it safe so this is like test number seven i don't lost track yo like it's crazy i'm ready for this mess to go away but i'm in the public now I'm back in the pub public at my job, so yeah, I just I'm just being, you know, aware of stuff. Uh, and I try to keep my distance, but you know, you in the certain location and you know, people come in, it's kind of and I um, at my job is it's roomy, but it's not that roomy, so I'm just playing it safe because I heard some of the co workers like they be coughing. At it. I mean, and I know that's normal though because I have I sneeze a lot and because I have all your sinus problem issues, but you know, I ain't trying to, I ain't trying to play that, but yeah, it's um, what time is it? It's 7 31, they open up at 8. And I know they get packed, y'all. They get so packed. So right now I'm the fourth car in line, so I'm gonna stay here because I was it. And then they only um test for like so many hours in the morning, and then they stop, and then they do it again at one, I believe. You can be in this line forever, forever, forever. I mean, if people think I'm talking to myself. Which I am. I'm not talking. I don't know. I know people be looking at me weird because we don't have a lot of bloggers around here or YouTubers. I had a um, truck that drop off patients, you know, take them to the appointments. Well, this one, um, he let the guy out for his appointment and left him. Yeah, I mean, he, he got 30. 29 minutes, you know, but still, he dropped them off when I was telling y'all, but I don't think, I don't know if they, oh, it's, yeah, 28 minutes, but, um, yeah, so I'm just waiting, I'm gonna let y'all know what it's gonna be, I just don't wanna be around family, and that's how the jump spread, you know, where it just, Oh, that's okay. Then you be around your family and spread it. Um, I ain't trying to get my grandparents sick. Like, we all had it the first time, but. Mm -mm. No. Nah. But I keep y'all updated. Y'all, I just got it. I wanted y'all to see, but I had to get something out my phone. So, but y'all already know. Y'all seen me get it done before. Plenty of times.
Yes, ma'am. Yes. I had a jacket on, but whatever. Come on, nigga. So she said 45 minutes to an hour. Shit. What time is it? 16 minutes after 8. They need to cut these bushes back. They can't see shit. That's an accident. Uh, so I can just park in the uh, parking lot when I come back. But yeah, I had a jacket. I don't want to think about it. And I had my windows up. So, whatever. Uh, Lord, please let this test come back negative, Lord. But uh, I need to go. Um, damn, they don't open to nine. I need to get my medicine because um, I ain't take my other beta blocker. I thought I had some more in my cabinet because I just got medicine, but that wasn't in the bag for some reason. But I'm about to um, go somewhere and eat it. But yeah, um, I wanted y'all to see the process, but y'all seen the process. Y'all know how it goes. Um, y'all saw when I got my last one. Well, one of them. Y'all seen one of them. But this is, she was like easy because the ones at the hospital. They try to like touch your deck on brain, like you have your nose hurt, but that ain't hurt at all. So, yeah. But I'm gonna let y'all know. I'm gonna turn the cameras back on once I get back there. I'm trying to see if I can get my medicine. But, yeah, I'll be back. Y'all, so I'm sitting here waiting now. I just got back because I'm gonna go get me some breakfast. I'm at the Hardee's. And got me a biscuit, and I got a cinnamon roll. It, and it's a they had a um a license and an insurance card, so we had to come back. But so I was driving. I was like, I gotta go. So I was driving with no no license and stuff. But just my city. <laughs> but I ate my biscuit, but I do got a cinnamon roll. But these cinnamon rolls be busting. Look at it. That shit's soft. I'm gonna eat that when I get to the creek. House of Betty and I was saying that. But, but um, I'm just waiting. They said 45 minutes. It's been 45 minutes. But they said 45 minutes to an hour. So it's been a little bit. So fucking sad. Peace in. I mean the other car is like the one that I just got, so I don't know what that was. Give me an alarm in the car. Mm. But anyways, yeah, I'm just waiting for those results. Lord, if it's gonna be good. My temperature, I had a jacket on before. It was 99.5. And I just took it back off. Cause it's chilly out here. And I had it warm in my car. Well, that's still good though. Those ain't no 103, 105. I don't know what that man talking about, but he throwing his hands up in the air like he fed up. I gotta go home. 
It's like it's about to pour down. Y'all see the sky? And people think I'm talking to myself and everything else. So, um, it's so weird. It's so weird. So weird. Yeah, I party at the front so they can see me. Like, everybody parking at the back. I, you might miss me. I need you to come over here. Are you looking for my car? Sorry. Come on. Come on, come on with it. Yeah, like, he, uh, you don't know, see him, you can see him. He, like, he, um, going to Hawaii, he just shut on. He got this, uh, we got this. Good, and you? Good, I'm Michelle and Lapita, I'm over your whistle. Uh, You're negative. Okay, thank God. Awesome. <laughs> Were you previously positive like this last few weeks? Uh, I was positive in July, the end of July. Gotcha. So. Okay, well you are all set. Okay, okay thank you so Have much. You too. <laughs> Lady, what are you doing? No, you don't look me doing that, y'all. Let me show y'all this. What we got going on? That thing say big negative. Y'all see that? I hope y'all see that. Oh, let me give y'all a better look. Negative. Hallelujah. Y'all see that? 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 Y'all see I'm so grateful for y'all and I pray that y'all never get it because when I tell you, it, it, I mean, it affects everybody different, but uh, you go ahead and pull it out. Pull out. Pull out, you want to. You're about to be buying me another car. Where did I make it? Uh, oh, wait, what time I but yeah, it's negative. And still, I'm still practicing my distance. Um, stay. Well, I was doing all that before, so I can't say because I went through like cleaning, like I was cleaning all. I'm, I still be cleaning. You know what? When I get home, because you know I get my schedule, my work schedule just been all over the place. But I'm off today. I'm sorry, y'all bouncing all over the place. This is a bumpy ass road. But I'm off today. I'm going to. I'm about to go home and clean my house. Y'all know I hate trash, so y'all already know we got to make a dumpster run. I don't know if I'm going to record it, but I don't want to go to the dumpster. Um, mop my floors. I, I recently wiped down my walls. And y'all, you know I'm old fashioned because. If y'all know nothing about wiping the walls down, y'all did not grow up with y'all grandparents. Because my grandma, she would have us, um, <laughs> on the weekend, she would have us getting up, get up. Is this one of my own boys? I think so. Um, anyway, she would have us get up on the weekend, put on that gospel music, and it's cleaning day. Like, we, everybody, she wake everybody up in that house. All my cousins can bounce it there. We had to get up. We had Dwayne. I'm saying everybody. Lord, yeah, everybody's like, damn, she know everybody. But anyway, she had us get up, clean everything from the from the corners down to the bottom of the other corner. Like we was like, we did everything. My that did not play bad. Then. But now, grandma, the grandparents lacking off like these. Now the new generation with the grandkids, they don't gotta do shit. They can sit there and play video games. We didn't do we didn't do that. We had to do our, you know, we clean all that, and then you um, get to play. You take your ass outside. Go out, <laughs> go outside. Climb a tree, climb a tree or something. Jump rope. That's that was um, what we do. Now. They got the electronics, they got, you know, they got everything. And they were like, if they say it, they're like, I don't feel like doing it. They're like, okay. You said that back in the day, like, tell your mama or your grandparent that, you know, like, I ain't, I don't feel like doing it. Boy, I'll watch something go across your damn head so quick. 
so so quick. It's either going across your bed. Like my grandma, she used to get those. I call them a whip thing, but they were switch like the switch, but not them, not them little skippy, like them, not no ones that be breaking all the time. I really respect it, and I'm older because it taught me a lot. But she didn't do it all the time. But she had like if you um, get in trouble, she get that switch, and this ones they had a little. There was a, I forgot no little um, thorns or something. I ain't, I ain't gonna say thorns cause that sounds so bad getting beat. But there was a long ass switch and she used to get two or three of them, or three of them and tie them together. And you cut up, you want to, like she, she, she didn't even have to get up. She's like, shoo. Like, jeez. I was like, I remember like one time y'all, I'm telling like, y'all all these stories. Like I, I'm, I guess I was now. But that can't go out of my room because I resist that. You know, it's old fashioned. It's just back in the day. But anyways, uh, one time it was me, my uh, my two cousins. I forgot what we did, and my grandma was like, "Do it, y'all. Y'all better do something." And Ruth is like laughing off, boy. She grabbed that that long ass switch that was tied together. Tied together, she um she swung that thing, and we all know about her like swinging this jump rope. So how about all of us jump and we jump whatever? Like she swung it, we was like we would jump rope it. Like we was like, mm -mm, Grandma, you ain't gonna hit us today, boy. That joke was so funny. Like I had so many memories from like growing up in my grandma's house. Those were the days, y'all. Ain't nothing about the beat. But like it makes you respect like so much more like dang like if it wasn't for I feel like if it wasn't for half of the stuff that I uh, went through I got hit the bear on y'all went through I think I don't think I would be um like I am now. I probably be one of them kids like just don't give a fuck about nothing but um but yeah like it just made me it makes me respect like so much more and then now I got kids of my own and I see how they be trying they be trying to do the same junk that I was doing. I'm like I used to do that same thing. But I'ma beat y'all too. I do believe in beating like I ain't say like beat your kids. Yeah. But I I believe in this one that way. Anyway. Like cause you're not about to run up with me. If you one of mine, I can't. I can't help what other people do with the kids. Like, yeah, they're like, you should talk to him. You, you should talk to Johnny and all that. I try to talk to Johnny. Johnny has run over it and think he, he think it's a joke. Um, I am not your little friend. Ain't nothing to play around with. I'm down. I'm about business. Don't let the sides fool you, baby, because I'm knock you down. But anyway.